A week ago, the Raffles Hotel was saying there was no lycra ban, and this week there is. The Applecross Hotel has now officially banned cyclists wearing lycra, saying it's been overwhelmed with public support to lock out bike riders. No lycra or no service. After claiming its ban on cycle wear was a misunderstanding, the Raffles Hotel has made the rule official. And it's about people um, who've exercised quite strenuously and uh, they can be very sweaty. Uh, sometimes may not realise realise that that uh, exercise has caused them to have a BO or, or uh, an appearance that uh, people do find offensive. It comes after four cyclists were turned away from the hotel last week. At the time, the raffles denied it was anti-lycra. Now it claims customers support the ban. See, it's only since we've seen the public's response to the supposed lycra ban that uh, we understand how the public feel about it and have decided to make it our dress code. A sign outside the hotel warns anyone wearing lycra cycle wear will be refused entry, along with people wearing high-vis clothing, dirty workwear or board shorts. Cyclists that. say they're being picked on. If I feel more people are going to shout abuse at cyclists, you know, the lycra, it just uh, facilitates the genuine dislike for cyclists in Perth. Under the Liquor Control Act, the Raffles is allowed to set its own dress standard and refuse to serve people who don't comply. Some fishermen claim they've also been asked to leave because of their clothes. But down the road at Toscanini's Cafe, they're welcoming the lycra-clad crowd. No matter how many of them rock up, uh, we've never turned them away. We've never asked them to move or go. Um, they're welcome any time. Estelle Lewis, Nine News.